Hello friends, I am Ragdoll Riversong and this is of course Sims 4. We are in Moonwood Mill. I love this little area. I haven't had a lot of time to go and explore it today or any other day for that matter. But we are back with our rags to riches Sims and I think she needs a few roommates. We may work on that today as well. I'm not sure. Um, if we do, the question is, do we make them go through the rags to riches challenge as well in her little neighborhood? Or do we just let them live their peaceful little life on their lot? Like we could let this one buy their lot and just kind of keep up with the bills and have to get a job and stuff. And this one we could possibly do the one square challenge because it's kind of empty. I would like to check out the Moonwood Mill Library and also Grimtooth Bar and Bunker and see what all's going over there too because I haven't had a chance like I mentioned and it's very awesome looking. I think we should go explore this little cave as well maybe and look how beautiful the pond is and the little moon shape. Oh, so pretty. Love it. <laughs> Again, I'm Ragdoll River Song. If you're new to my channel, I play Sims, I play Dreamlight Valley, I play Animal Crossing. Today we're working on my Rags to Riches Sim. She started in one square with no money. We bankrupted her and this is as far as we have gotten so far. Like, she's got... All of her basic necessities met, but her house isn't too pretty. So, <laughs> it's not perfect, but it's it's hers, you know? And it's, you know. <laughs> oh, the Humor and Hijinks Festival is in town at 5 p.m. I think we should send her. Let me click my little <laughs> ad event thing here and it will notify us whenever it's time to go I'm gonna let her get her sleep in and let her go eat and all of that jazz and yeah she's got a little bit of money maybe we can get her to paint sell a painting things like that and then we'll send her on over to the festival <laughs> Oh, our mail has been delivered. She's uncomfortable. That means bills. Well, 308 is not that bad. You need to calm down. Your painting will cover that. <laughs> You've been doing great. This is Star Song, by the way. <laughs> Okay, so we're going to sell our painting while she eats. I love how they multitask now. And I'm going to go ahead and get on my phone and pay my bills. I don't know what we just accomplished, but we did something great. Uh, finish eating your eggs and toast, too. I was hoping she would multitask with that, but she did not. How funny. <sighs> okay, so why don't you clean up after yourself and then how about you go use the restroom, take a shower, and after all that, Let's see if we can get her to come back and do a painting. What kind of painting do we want to see? I love all of them. I've been trying to have her do a, a wide range of different paintings. So let's have her do a large abstract painting. And hopefully we can sell that for a good amount before we leave for the Humor and Hijinks Festival in a little bit. She seems relatively happy, which is great. Let's see what these little goals above her head are. Level up in painting skill. I don't know. I thought... Let's see. Let's see. 
what are her skill levels? I thought she was top level of painting. Oh, nope, she has one more level to go, which is awesome. Stay on lot for eight hours. Well, we're about to go to the Humor and Hijinks Festival in a minute. So, I don't think I want to pin that one. <laughs> I don't know if we're going to make it to the eight hour mark. I like watching them paint. Their little creations are amazing. Oh wow, almost a thousand dollars. Fantastic. <laughs> All right, you have fun. Do whatever you want to do for the next little bit, and then we'll head on over to the festival. She wants to paint more. That a girl. <laughs> she knows how to pay her bills. <laughs> Anzerpa Nulitz Jasapa. Oh, kids. <laughs> huh. It's really ah. pretty. <laughs> She's admiring it as she paints it. <laughs> I think we have a few paintings in inventory. Oh, just one. A large surrealism painting. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, it's the one that's a tree of life looking thing. I really like this one. It's one of her first paintings. It's not worth a whole lot of money, but it's really pretty to me. And I like it a lot. I think we'll keep it hanging on her wall and she can use it for inspiration if she wants. We can frame it. <laughs> This is another one that she does a lot that I kind of like. I don't think I liked it after I put a frame around it, though. So if it comes out looking beautiful like the last one. Well, the other one I thought had a little more blue going this way, but I could be mistaken. I think I'm going to go ahead and sell it because that means she could have a little bit of time off and it's worth 900 and that's amazing. <laughs> the Humor and Hijinks Festival is very soon. She has a lot of money. Her bills are paid. She's feeling super confident. That is wonderful for her. I think after the festival, we start improving the outside and maybe the inside appearance of her home and get it looking a little nicer, maybe looking like something she would actually live in. You know? <laughs> Not saying she wouldn't actually live here, but decorate it to be more her style. And we are gonna pop on over to the festival. We only know one person, I guess. 
I think we're just going to travel it alone and meet some new people because she doesn't know anybody really. Okay, here's our group of folks. Is everyone uncomfortable or are we all... Oh, wait. What did I tell her to do? <laughs> We're all just running off. Where is the festival? A little bit too close in to see. Oh, she's headed there. Wonderful. I may let her choose which side she wants to drink from. This side is... What does it say? Does it not tell me which one is which? Pranksters. There we go. Jokesters. Let's do jokesters. I think I did pranksters with a different sim. Although the purple glow with her outfit would have been a lot prettier. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> We are supposed to prank the jokesters, or the pranksters, I mean. Let me go over here and see who we can talk to. Be sarcastic about voodoo, it says. <laughs> uh, I hope this is getting me points for my team, I'm not really sure. <laughs> oh, she likes my jokes. Impersonate Prankster. That might be a bit too far. We'll see. The jokesters are in the lead by four. Keep performing interactions for your team to earn. Woohoo! Doing wonderful. Coke fun at pranksters. Let's try our old material. <laughs> We're in the lead. Uh -oh. 
Alright, where did everybody go? This lady is drinking some of that potion, so... We'll talk to her. We're going to tell her about our meme. <laughs> we know about it. Uh, and... Sarcastic about voodoo. And then we're gonna impersonate the prankster. Poke fun at the pranksters. Dag dag. Ah, dag dag. Ah, wobble. I don't know how long we have to keep this up, but I think we're doing all right. Dwee, Ferovi, Physique, Fuzz, Move! Barobi. How do we have fireworks? I forgot about the little stalls where you can buy things. She's really impressed by that. Uh, let's get her some food. And maybe they don't have any kind of. I thought they had a t shirt for this one. Overhead, wonderful. Let's see, who else can we talk to? Is his glow pink or yellow? He's a prankster. <laughs> Bit of trouble using chopsticks. How funny. She's oh, she's performing Ah, wobble. Oh. And she's just here having fun. <laughs> Quasaru, She's Jungi, like, I have no part Jarb. in this. Please, please leave me out of it. I just want to sit here and enjoy my terrific lunch. Oh, it's a little too hot for him as well. Oh, I learned how to make two of the 27 recipes. That's cool. Fireworks. A comedy mic, fireworks, and 500. Woohoo! My team won. Yay! I like the fireworks a lot. It was really cool. So if I decide to keep the fireworks for later, does that mean that I can set them off at any time I want, like around my house? <laughs> it's so pretty! Oh, she needs a bathroom. Where is she at? Hey. Ho, 
I think there's some, yeah, there's a bathroom way over there. You got this. <laughs> we'll let her take care of that. I think all the vendors are leaving. The festival is closing down. Seems like it went rather quickly. <laughs> it's really beautiful, though. I love the little chalk drawn patterns that are disappearing slowly. <laughs> this one's one of my favorites. Okay, I guess we go ahead and send her back home. She got to get out of the house and meet a few new people. That's good for her. <laughs> So we have even more money to decorate with. That's great too. Because we want to fix her home a little bit. Let me go ahead and zoom out a little. I think the outside of her house is okay except where I expanded it over here in the back. Is this enough room? Do we need to add? I think the size of the home is finally really good for her. <clears throat> if I wanted to, I could expand the wall and put in an archway and that would make it a little more complete. Let's put her first piece of art over here. Well, not her very first, but you know. <laughs> remember my controls. I need to place a wall. There we go. Now let's go find her some awesome wallpaper. Something very artistic and lovely because she has a flair for the artistic and the dramatic and she's been working really hard lately to get her house what she wants it to be so maybe <laughs> we give her something beautiful and unique look at this one it has little birds everywhere that's so pretty i don't know if it really fits her whole vibe though <laughs> kind of does. It kind of matches the furniture and brings it together a bit. The little tree even blends in well. Let's go see about a door. I'm thinking archway. Oh, it's in our way. Let me go see because I'm not sure I like it right there. Surely not the light. What's in the way? <laughs> That's funny. Is it our easel? I'm not really sure, but... We can pull that over here for a moment. There we go, it is because I kind of like it more towards the middle. And then... It's like, yeah, you can't do that. You thought you were going to, but you can't do that. Put it there though, and I'm gonna put another window for her. Maybe we get better windows too, something a little prettier.
Oh, I forgot about the outside and the kitchen. I want. She lived in a box for so long. I feel like she would want something pretty, but she would also want something that lets a lot of light through. <laughs> That's kind of huge, though. It does indeed let a lot of light in. Maybe in our living room. kitchen as well. I don't think we should have those huge windows in our bedroom or our bathroom though. <laughs> or put a giant curtain over the one in the bedroom. I don't know. enough windows for now. We'll work on the other ones later. Let's get a prettier color in her kitchen. Paint or... very bright and colorful for her. Seems to fit her personality very well. <laughs> and what siding is on the outside of the house? It's kind of hard to tell because it's dark. I may let her go back to, or go inside and go to bed before I try to do the outside. For the bedroom. like this one but I don't know we may need a new bed for her as well I think I kind of like this one let's see about the colors though I kind of like the blue and yellow it looks sort of like she's been painting on her walls you know even a little bit goes with the bed, but I think I want to change the bed, maybe. She has earned enough money that I feel like she deserves an upgrade in some of her furniture at this point. What is she sleeping on at the moment? Energy of three and stress relief of two. We could go for an energy of five. It's gonna make us really broke. <laughs> Do we have we don't have a painting started, so let's not be too greedy and let's go with this one maybe. Oh, it's kind of prettier too, and it it has an energy of five. 
Let me see. Yellow and brown. I kind of like this one. Oh, that's the one. Yeah, that's the one for our girl. She's She's got really eclectic taste. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of your bed here, sweetie. And we're gonna have that one in the corner over there. Got to do the outside here, the walls. But yeah, she definitely needed a new bed. What is the wallpaper we're using? It won't tell me, huh? Oh, isn't that just about right? Suspiciously unremarkable. It's not that bad. Okay, what kind of windows do we want in the bathroom and bedroom? I guess we could just put curtains on that one. too busy though so a little bit. I left her a little bit of money so she doesn't have to work if she doesn't want to. But she can. <laughs> She's so playful and happy right now. That's great. And her house is looking very pretty and bright. We'll try to keep her in a good mood, maybe build an upstairs for her, and possibly expand her family, you know? Give her new goals, like children, or find her a significant other. <laughs> Excuse me, hydration is important. <laughs> But right now she seems quite happy learning new things, like learning how to cook and getting familiar with her surroundings. I think before we look into expanding the family, we upgrade all of her appliances, get her a better stove, refrigerator, things like that. Maybe have the children's room prepared, all of that kind of thing first. <laughs> but yeah, she's doing pretty well. She says, uh-huh. <laughs> it is looking rather fancy. <laughs> Considering she started in a box with no windows, no doors. <laughs> I think she's playing pranks on the internet now. The next thing we're going to upgrade is her flooring because this is all all good and well for now, but <laughs> it needs a little bit of an upgrade.
I like to kind of see what she does on her own and let her try to take care of her own needs a little bit. If she wants to paint, we let her paint. If she wants to go grab a bite, let her grab a bite. <laughs> I love that she now has a giant window to paint in front of. I'm sure that she gets a lot of inspiration from that. I do think we should move our lamp, though. It seems like it's in the way just a little bit and possibly better in the corner. There we go. Functional living space. <laughs> I see my smoke detector on the window over there. How funny. What a lovely painting. It's not even on the same side as the stove. Oh, she painted a masterpiece. That is very cool. Good for you. I know they're very hard to come by, but you know, <laughs> this is her only source of income. So let's do a confident painting while we're at it. I just want her to have it on the canvas and then she can go ahead and grab a bite. I think, oh, that's the male person. Let's have her serve breakfast. And then she can put a few of those in the fridge and not have to eat so many quick meals. Actually, I meant to get her a better refrigerator, too, before I did all this, so the quality of the food would be better, but that's okay. We'll let her do this first. Ah, Glen uh -huh. Ah. Oh, when who? She's so oh. proud of herself. Zagu. Mm -hmm. Because <laughs> everyone smacks their pen like that. Let her have some breakfast, and then we'll have her put the breakfast away. Awesome. Ah. <laughs> She's like video games, of course. Everybody knows. You gotta take a little bit of your time and have some video game time. What are you reading? Browse books. Here, resume your painting, dear. Let's get that artistic ability level all the way up if we can today. It's taking a little bit longer than I thought it was gonna. Ooh, a confident painting. Climbing up that hill. I do. What is going on, Selena Lopez? Would like to come over. Sure, oh. come hang out. Uh, 
So, and hello, friend. How's it going? Yeah, sure. Have fun on my computer. <laughs> Here, I'm going to pause. And since we have a little bit more money, I'm going to go into build mode. I'm going to steal her refrigerator and her stove. Oops. I didn't want it in inventory. And then we're gonna go on over here into kitchen items and get her something a little bit nicer. What can we afford? Food quality of six. What did we have before? It had to be like this one, I'm sure. So, a food quality of four is a vast improvement. Let's go for it. And then, what kind of stove can we now afford? I think we had this thing before, so this is really a good improvement as well. We got about $200 left, so that's great. How about you go ahead and serve lunch? Why don't you work on grilled cheese and let your friend play on the computer? Maybe y'all can sit down and have lunch together and chit chat. Let's go call our friend to the meal. Now they can socialize for a little bit, get to know each other a little better. <laughs> Is a mixologist at the bar and bunker. Awesome. We were gonna go check that place out. Oh, they merged into one. <laughs> How peculiar. She's feeling confident and focused. Well, wonderful for you, girl. Why don't you use the restroom? <laughs> and we'll let our friend hang out a little bit. Yes, please wash your hands. And then go put away the food. <laughs> yes. That way we have extra leftovers and we don't have to cook so much for the next week. Maybe no tummy aches from, you know, quick meals. Oh, apparently our friend is a vampire? Goblet Sharky! Green! <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, Jordan. And go. Paris Boo. Has a new. Yep. Soon off. Snape. That Goldie. is cool. She has Sir. a new friend. Uh, Mathematical well, diagram is something we can do. All right. So is it worth something? Tourib. Boo. <laughs> That is awesome. Acquired logic skill. Web. Freak of Play card games, Freak. chess, and huh. use scientific ah. equipment. Awesome. Oh, 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 
<laughs> oh, Dolphus. She Dolphus seems very Leo. happy with herself. Liz? Bankira. Ah, ha. Nibahana. A pleba. Ha, ha. Oh, Dolphus. Hmm. Dolphus Ravuda. Ogariz. Bankira. Ah, ha. Uh, uh -huh. Nibahana. She's like, a bye. Pleba. See you later, friend. Pomare. <laughs> oh, Floney <laughs> Alupaz. Parasa. Askinau. Suna. Ah, uh, ah, uh -huh. Nibahana. A pleva. Pomare. Logic skill went up. Did her Suna. painting level? Ah, uh, aha, Nibahana, a pleva, Pomare. No, yeah. Oh, Dolphus. Dolphus Ravuda, Ogariz, Bankira. Ah, uh, aha, <laughs> Nibahana, a oh, Floney. <laughs> It's very interesting looking. Oh, this is a masterpiece. Interesting. It's a masterpiece worth $114. All right. Well, I think she is well on her way, and she is doing fantastic. Vroom. Huh. <laughs> we don't even have to prompt her to really paint anymore, which is her primary source of income. She doesn't really have a job, if you haven't been following along. She did the one square challenge, Rags to Riches, and everything she has, she has acquired from either taking photographs of herself to sell, or she has been painting photographs, or painting portraits, I mean, to sell. <laughs> she has bought everything she has from either the flea market or acquired it from buying it all by herself. She's done great. <laughs> and things are actually starting to come together nicely in her place for her. Very proud of our sim. <laughs> Hope you'll join me next time. We'll try to level her up a little bit better, get her some more cabinets, like different things like that, make her bathroom look good, get her bedroom a few new items. Oh, she has a little more money. Yeah, we kind of need the cash. I'm gonna have her go ahead and do she's getting a lot of money for her paintings lately let's go ahead and have her do one of those we'll upgrade her cabinets and things like that as I mentioned next time and we'll give her some, maybe some cabinets in the bathroom and definitely some curtains <laughs> I do hope you will join me if you're not already subscribed please do it's free it'll let you know when I go live and I hope all of you have the loveliest of days. And thank you so very much for spending some time with me today. Bye, friends. Uh, oh. Timmy. Huh. <laughs> Thank you.